Hey, what's up, guys? Max here. And today we got the update. Today's Sunday, which was a big day for us to wait because we were going to get more information into what the trade in store is going to look like. And it's not that good, you know, so uh, we'll make a separate video when it comes to the updated version of the trade in store, kind of my ideas on it. Um, might give you some in the middle of this whole video, but the purpose of this video is to now go ahead and pick up this guy, okay? This guy's pretty good because um, if you're going to be participating in the part of the uh, unit, or not even unit, because we're getting no units inside these, um, un un unless we get those crystals, pop these crystals, and they do have guaranteed units, but it's not going to be, it's only five crystals. Uh, so we'll take a look at those two um, and kind of see what kind of results we get out of those units. But um, this is going to give us basically enough. Um, it should be enough to open with what I have in inventory uh, to open a uh, seven star. So we're back to back on seven stars. And basically, it's all part of this uh, event. Um, but it's not part of the kind of like free to play portion of the event or just doing content portion of the event, at least that's kind of my take on it. So let's go ahead and get this and pick up those shards. Um, and then kind of like, we'll do this in portions because I think these two, I got more to say and um, don't know if the expectations, sh I should even wait for next Friday when it comes to like the trade in store, because I don't think there's going to be anything um, um big that's coming for that specific friday but, but who knows i really don't know so let's get this and then be right back. okay so now that we have 11 of these items we can trade them in and go for that seven star uh crystal and i don't know like i said cross my fingers to see basically what we get out of this now uh, when it comes to the trade-in store that's event i should say that's going on at the moment um as you can see, I participated basically on the, I have tons of these in my inventory. I wish there was a little bit more than just a purchase limit of one because I have 17 overflow of these guys and it would be nice to kind of like, you know, get rid of some uh, because there's basically no use. Now, this is my account situation, even having like seven and these come in quite rapidly now would be nice, but um, as you can tell, basically I picked up the gold offers, um, even with the limited amount of gold is because I'm confident that I have some gold crystals that I can go ahead and pop and just kind of get that stash back up. I was very close to like 20 million in gold. I think it was, I did a couple of rank ups and, and the trade in. So it got me down to 5 million in gold. So, um, yeah, that's kind of so far what I've been able to get from this uh, event with the trade-in options. So um, as you can tell from the last opening, I only I only have 640 shards uh, for the seven star crystal. So we're gonna go ahead and um, go a little back and forth and man, just hope we get some really good RNG on side, inside this crystal. I really hope so. Uh, yeah, like I said, the last pool that we got, if you haven't seen it, it's on it's the video, yesterday's video, but um, don't wanna spoil it but it was very lucky. So um, if we can get the same RNG luck continued on day two on these seven stars, dude, I feel kind of crazy being able to do two seven stars back to back, one just yesterday and one today. Let's see what we're gonna land on again. Oh my gosh, dude. I can't believe we got this guy. This guy sucks. <laughs> <laughs> At least not not necessarily bad, but I know there's some people that love him. Hawkeye, he's favorite of some players. I myself is not is not a champion that I would care to use or even just rank up. To be honest, I will level him up because of level up points. But Hawkeye is probably one of the for me worst pools you can get. I was so close to Venom. I was so I was so excited. That's why I was like like a sense of like oh my gosh it's gonna happen right now it's gonna happen this is gonna be all worth it and i was gonna be able to say hey it was all worth it we got venom but we added hawkeye and he when it comes to scale he is basically what is it my fifth seven star um i know we gotta get past these lemons these these are pretty bad pulls uh for me you know again not, not most people might not agree on hawkeye but i'm just not gonna use him i, I really care more for at the moment other certain events caught or certain game modes and hawkeye just doesn't do it you know but um yeah i hope not to get him again ever again 
Uh, I really do. Even with the buff, I don't really care much about them. But okay, so the trade-in uh, store, um, for me, you know, I get another seven star. That's super cool, especially for like arena points and just grinding in general. It allows me to get more points inside the arena, quicker to the milestones, quicker to get the arena done and over with. But is it worth it? Was it worth it um, at the end trading in um, uh, my shards that I just got basically for the seven star Hawkeye? No, it's not. So um, I wish we would have gotten that Venom. Even a dupe on the Gwen that I just picked up would have been kind of cool. Um, yeah, just Hawkeye. I mean, man, dude, v Venom would have been really nice, especially since I'm sitting on a couple of rank, uh, rank up materials to be able to take a seven star to rank two. Uh, I, that would have been really good to just be like, hey, Venom, let's go. You're going to rank two. But that didn't happen. Good luck to you guys if you're now going to be participating on uh like i said you know start start picking up some of these uh offers basically um uh yeah even if i were to get all of these i don't i will sit, do some math figure out like how how co quickly or close can i get to another seven star um but i was hoping that i would get a seven star uh basically to like be able to kind of like organize basically these tier six catalysts because those are going to they're going to be important to what champions I want to rank up, right? So I was really hoping that that was going to be the case and I was going to be able to do that. So we move on and we go on to the next portion of this event. Um, my next opening, uh, just so you guys know, if you have not subscribed and you want to be uh, part of this and just kind of like be on the lookout for this, definitely hit the notification. But this rank up gem is coming up next um, as I basically kind of... Um, I have eyes on two champions, so hopefully one of those classes does show up on this Nexus. Um, but we're going to take a look. And if it does, we level them up, rank them up right away. Take care, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to drop a like on this one. Peace.